Hi all, now after the episode 4 we have an views from the New Republic fleet to analyze what ships are inside it. After probably the best images from the fleet I go to analyze them in order of apparition. First the S-Wings, they look as the classic H-Wing. It will be from this type. The Mon Calamari 30, perhaps C model, there are many views, even in some points too much. I have showed you it before in other recording. A model from the Mon Calamari 30 made by Evel Jelly time ago. But probably the model made by a petroglyph in the game Star Wars Impeded War Forces of Corruption is more similar. It is the model from Evel Jelly that you can find in my Alliance Rebellion. And it is the first 3D model that we have seen from that ship in the world. It is the turn for the Hong Wang. This Hong Wang is very curious because she does not remember to the ship from the episode 6. I am not sure about the length, colors and more. There are several images and some of them the ship is wrong. When we compare it to other ships around it, it looks smaller. But it was a very big ship with more of 3000 meters in length. Of course, I have told you many times how you cannot trust an images where you do not know the real distance between units. It is the picture watched in the episode 4 that it is so strange by the colors, but perhaps it is a reflection from the planet, space or other thing.
Soon now for the A wings. These are probably the ships that everybody can recognize. But next in the fleet there are a lot of other ships. It is a Nebulon B frigate, one could use because it has Solange engines, when this ship used before white engines. It remembers me to the Quenfis, a Nebulon B frigate commanded by the captain Virgilio. Curiously, that ship was in the books and comics from the trilogy of the New Republic. Before watching Ahsoka, for me it looks as a remake from the Hair of Empire story. Where everybody are probably thinking, what is Leia or Han Solo? Are they making babies? Retires from the stand for sure. Better they do not use that characters because when they use them they make a mess most of the times. There are two groups of ships duplicated a lot around the fleet. One are the Codellian Corvettes, there are several. Finally, the last ship that we can find in the fleet, it is the Spinma Corvette. Probably you remember it from the Rogue One film.
Well, I do not go to count the ghosts or the T6 shuttle as part of the New Republic fleet, just they are visitors, and especially the ghosts everybody can recognize it. Now thinking, in my opinion, the rebel shutters are the replacement from Lucas Finch for Han Solo, Luke, Lando, Leia, and more. And I like the idea because the old shutters are old and these new ones are better with these times. Of course, with the exception from Mark Hamill, who he always is involved in the saga, all the other old actors, just they were not interested, they are dead or they are very old. Especially Harrison Ford because he hates Star Wars. By that reasons, I like these new characters with these actors. It is clearly the beginning from a new era in the Star Wars universe. Well, it is then. I hope discover new more things soon in Ahsoka, especially new vehicles, ships and more. Thanks by watching the video.